people transparency, control, and protect their security. There's a tremendous amount of experimentation going on, but it is essential from an industry point of view that we provide privacy because people will not use our products if they don't trust them. Uh, safety, we can do a lot to give people the tools of control to protect themselves and their children and their communities, and the uh, community itself can do a lot online to do that. Openness, interoperability is essential in this new media. We have a group at Google called the Data Liberation Front. It's a very amusing name, but it's a group of engineers that literally walk around product to product and make sure that people can take their data with them, and that's something that consumers should demand. Another thing, though, that we need is industry cannot do this alone. We need the help of government. Uh, a lot has been said in some of the sessions about the importance of free expression uh, and the dangers and risks to free expression around the world. We need government to help us and to use the tools at its disposal to protect free expression. Uh, uh, we need more transparency from government about when it government itself is asking for content to be removed or uh, asking for data about users. And we also need good uh, legal regimes that allow social media to develop, particularly protections around intermediary liability. We do not want a world where the people, the providers of social media services are themselves forced to become gatekeepers. So I would just say there is much for us to be done. Freedom uh, and openness on the internet is not an inevitability. Uh, it's something we all have to work for. We're delighted to be part of this conversation uh, at IGF, and I congratulate the organizers for this. Thank you.